Okay. Good evening, good afternoon, or good morning, depending on where it is you're watching. Finally, I've got my game to load today. Um, it seems to take an absolute age today, but here we are. Um, finally, we've got the game loaded up. So, good afternoon, everybody. Anyway, welcome to Davenport, if this is your first time here. And, uh, and maybe you're in for a bit of a treat, so let's go one last thing to do, guys, and then we are go, go, go for recording. Okay, we've got detailing on today, we've got disasters turned off. Um, we don't ever have disasters in this place. So, <laughs> so yeah, so, okay, cool. Um, by the way, hi guys, if you're watching me on the, on the YouTube on a catch-up, sorry you couldn't join us live. Um... I guess you're just shouting at me just as much as everybody else in the chat room normally shouts at me, so um, you don't really miss much. But by all means, if you do want to watch me live, uh, my stream Wednesdays at about uh, 1900 British summer time, which I think is 8 o'clock Central European time. And I'm usually around on a Saturday from about 1500 uh, British summer time, which again is about 4 o'clock. 1600 Central European time, so we're just going to fight the cat for a second. Well, let's have a look where we got up to. I did do a little bit of work offline, actually. So, that is something that I probably want to carry on today. And I want to kind of get this neighbourhood really up to speed, okay? Because this neighbourhood is... Uh, yeah, it needs working out, okay? Um, it needs doing... Keep having a few glitches with the land. Um, and apologies, by the way, if it all spins around a little bit slow. Um, it does jerk into view, unfortunately, but... So only because of the details that we've got, guys. So we finished kind of this area here um, the other week, which I think is beautiful. Um, I love how that looks. Um, I think that works really, really well. I'm not too sure about this tree overlapping with that, but what a... What a convenient place to have a petrol station, I think, or a gas station. What a, what a great place. And the bits I've done offline is just added... I'm going to probably do a little bit more work with this today. So we've just added like, things like this. So this gravel path took a while, actually, by the way. Good evening, Usman. Hello. Good afternoon. Um, it took a bit of time to actually add that gravel path all the way down here. Um, it's not actually a path, but I just thought we could do something a little bit different uh, with, this, with this kind of neighbourhood here. Um, Got the idea from something I did in a different part of the city, so might continue that down here. Don't know yet. I think I might have this area more as a park. So we're going to work that out. Um, but that's what we're going to be focusing on today, anyway, guys. So um, we are going to be focusing on getting uh, this area up to speed. So take a good look at it now, because it's probably going to be um, it's probably going to be a little bit different by the time we finish today. We do need, and one thing I might have to add in. Um, and maybe it's going to go in here, actually. There's a bit of a crematorium. We don't have a crematorium, unfortunately. My other option is to have it over here. Um. <laughs> troll away, Osman, troll away. The other area I might have a crematorium is here. But um, I've, not, I've not really considered that. And I think it would look cool in this gap here. We've got enough space here maybe for crematorium we need a fire station in this area as well the reason i say that is um what up the great smacks me by the way thank you very much for the host um much appreciated dude. i think we have one or two people dying over this part of the map okay um we have a few problems with the road here um i've obviously not done something right these cars are just super rubbish at taking this exit um, but that's how it goes. Um, Skynet, thank you very much for the host. Um, thank you guys, much appreciated. Um, at least it knows that I'm, at least I know I'm alive anyway, as well, so uh, that feels good. Okay, um, should we start with this? Yeah, we need, I, I don't think that's the right area for it. We've got our little petrol, little petrol station. We have a little central kind of police station down here. Um, let's have a little fire station here as well that, that kind of mimics that a little bit. And we'll do that, I think. Um, we'll get a fire station in here. We need one. We need the coverage. So let's see what we've got. Oh, look at some of these. Look at that bad boy. Okay, that's, that's not really what I'm looking for, though. Uh, we're probably just going to have this local one, I think. I'm a big fan of this one. Uh, nice and basic, nice and simple, nice and small. We don't need too much with it. Um, that's probably going to go. We're probably going to do something similar to what we did 
here with that one. We can have it. Can have it away from the road. So let's start with that. So good evening, anyway, US man. Hello, how are you? Um, seems a bit of a light stream today, which is uh, I don't mind too much in truth. Gives me a little bit of uh, gives me a little bit of a breather from having to talk to loads of people. So I think with this one, we are going to follow. Oh, let's see if we can follow that road. So, roughly something like that, I think. Uh, probably with a little bit more curve on it, I'd suggest. So, let's do something. Yeah, yeah, let's do it this way. Yeah, something like that. Curvage is going to be awkward to get right, I think. So, no, we're not going to do that. Let's go. Okay, I don't want this to be a three road though, that's my... Ah, <laughs> oh, I could do it a holiday, this man. Holiday would be good for me. I have one booked, I have one booked in a few weeks time, I think, so... Hopefully, hopefully then I get a little bit of time to myself, so I'm excited for it. I think we'll repeat kind of roughly what we have here, but we're not going to have this uh, walled area in like this. We're going to have um, probably just... Let's have a look how we're going to work this area out. Let's work through this. I just have some nice parking there, I think. So let's use our classic. Let's use our favourite parking, shall we? It's somewhere over here, I think. Somewhere around. Yeah. Um, we need to boost the land value up as well, so. So let's just have something. Even if it's as basic as that. For here. I should do. That'll, that'll keep that'll keep up the... Uh, the land value for me there. Um, that'll work. Okay, we've definitely got to separate from this path, which is going to be fun to do. So what I might do is... Do this. Let's see what we can do. Let's see what we can do. We are on a slow stream today, aren't we? I like it. I like it. I really want that one. I'm probably looking... Let's go a bit industrial on this one. So it is more just to keep people, just so I know whereabouts the path is, I guess. Uh, well, there's too many. So we'll go to about the... Well, that follows it reasonably, I think. So I don't want to make this yard too big, but... we'll have to work something out with it. Okay, let's do that. Let's just go straight there. Now that's going to cause me a problem. So, uh, whatever trying to be complex. Good afternoon, how are you? Um, I'm doing good, by the way, thank you guys. I really am doing good today. Um, it is Wednesday, it's midweek, I'm playing City Skylines. Who, who I might ask, could ask for more. Um... <laughs> Troll him once, man. Just troll him. Just troll him away, yeah? Um, the Strail Fence. Let's see if he brings anything up with that. <laughs> Get him once, man. Get him. So. Okay. So, we're going to have to put this in with a little bit of a bend on it, which is going to be really, really tricky to do. As it normally is. So, we're going to have to try and get that as straight as possible, which will be... Maybe not quite as far as that, but still. So, this is all a little bit by eye, as you can imagine. No, I think that's going to be okay. You'd love it. I'd love it to, to match up. That would be, uh, that would be excellent. I don't, I don't think I'm going to get that luxury here. Um, so, okay, so let's turn that, let's kind of turn that to our advantage, shall we? No, let's not. We want to fence this in. We don't want children playing with the uh, children playing with the fire engines. Okay. So I, I still, I still think I need to change that. So um, <laughs> what up, <laughs> CG4 man? Good afternoon. How are you? That is not what we want. Then. Good afternoon, guys. If ever you are, um, oh, thank you very much for the host. Thank you, man. Thank you very much for the host. Um, let me actually do this correct for a change. Um, guys, if you guys are ever looking for 
somebody to watch while uh, while I'm not online. Highly recommend having, heading over to uh, CG Foreman stream. I'm sure some of you might have already watched what he does. Um, I'm positive on that fact. But if you haven't, go check him out. Go check him out. That's all I'm going to say. Okay, so now that wants to go even further. I need to just change some of the parameters to this so the spacing needs to. Oh, this is really, really annoying me. No, the spacing needs to be this one. Hello, cat. I need to take the spacing down by one. Or by a little bit, like. There we go. That's what we're trying to aim for. So, um, that is where we're trying to aim for. Let's see if we can do that. Um, and then I'll catch back up with chat. Okay, if that's the case like that, then I will change the other line to match that line up. We can do that one a little bit easier than that. <laughs> oh dear. Yeah, I, you know, I was, I was messing around with... Oh, look at that. See? See, why does it do that? That is, that is just one piece there that is... Okay, so we'll fix that. But yeah, so I was messing around with my laptop and it went, oh, you need an update. I think I was trying to check the football scores or something from 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 last night, I think, or something like that. And it just updated and it took it over an hour to update. And I was like, oh, okay. So whatever I wanted to do is not happening now because it's time for me to go to bed. Um, this is what happens when you get old. Come on, there we go. We'll just change that. We'll try and sneak as much of it as possible. Okay, so that kind of just about... We can do a straight line there now as well, which would be easy to do. I think I want this side a little bit more industrial. Now, the problem I have is that fence is the wrong way around, so we're going to have to... Believe it or not, we're going to have to turn it 180 degrees just to make it match up with everything. Okay, so that's going to go to about... There, let's check that it's straight. No, we'll go from there, I think. Okay, that'll do me for that. Now, do I want to build a custom car park? Here's the question. Um, maybe I do, maybe I don't. We'll see. We're going to certainly run this fence down the back side of this anyway, so we'll just run this through the trees. Nobody will be able to tell. I won't tell anybody if you don't. Uh, that's the wrong way around again. Okay, I think we, we, we can get away with that. Not too many people are going to notice that anyway, so I'm happy with it anyway. Um, <laughs> well, have you seen that new mod, guys? For those of you that play this, I highly recommend that you get... Um, highly recommend that you get the don't crash mod which I've heard a lot about and I was desperately trying to get it before uh, before I went live today but I ran out of time but I've heard a lot of good things about it so yeah no crash or don't crash or yeah that mod looks awesome if it reduces my load times down then that means more time spent gaming and less time spent waiting for it to load up so um, that's what I can only hope for. I'm going to have to place these, these last couple by hand. Um, just because I want to try and get it. I have to overlap those a touch. Okay. It's hard to tell that. Hard to tell. Okay, hard to tell. Alright, okay, so that's going to fit in nicely with the rest of... Um, it's going to fit in nicely, I think, with the rest of the city around there. And then, like I say, we're going to go through pretty much one block at a time through here. And we are actually going to go and, and we're going to go and detail a hell of a lot of stuff today. Uh, once we've done this, anyway. Okay, so uh, we need some fire trucks. Obviously, I think fire trucks are going to be cool. I don't really want a road running through the middle of that. That looks like we could probably stick a fire engine coming out of that. That would be pretty cool. Um, so we're just going to have to concrete the rest of this in now. So let's do that. Let's um, let's get to work. Let's get to work. Yeah, I have seen it's incompatible. That's why I didn't. I was going to rush and get it, and then I was like, "Oh, I need to change the assets panel. I need to change this. I need to change that." And I was like, "I'm not doing it. I'm just not going to do it for the time being." So we're going to go up to about here. Uh, we'll, we'll concrete the rest of this side in, I think. Um, 
for those of you that are watching, yes, I know I can use. There are particular brushes I can use for this. I prefer not to, thank you. Um, I have my own personal reasons. And I'd rather not discuss them in a stream, thank you very much. Now, this is going to be a bit of a pain in the uh, hacienda because it's bent. We'll work it out somewhere. We'll work it out, there we go. Okay, so this is a big chunk of concrete that we're going to have to fill uh, with various fire engine related stuff. So what we might do is, what I might end up doing is extending this building out and seeing what the buildings we've got. So we can go from there. Um, what up Sergio Mexico 23? Good afternoon, thank you very much for the follow dude, much appreciated. Um, welcome, as they say, to Davenport. I'd like to think it's one of the most detailed cities that you can get now on the um, on the internet at the moment. Anyway, people are catching up. People are good at this game these days. I have to try and stay uh, a couple of details in front of people. Um, but welcome, welcome, welcome. Okay, so we'll do that. We've just got that little corner there. We need to just make sure that you can see that. So around the outside, basically, it's all going to be. Uh, we'll make sure that there's something that keeps it and, it and it'll look different from that by the time that we've finished it. But yeah, I think we need another building in here. In fact, you know what we might do? We, we might go we might go whole hog here. Um, we might actually see what other fire engine or fire buildings we've got. Um, hola, mi amigo! Hola! Um, let's see what other fire stations we've got. <laughs> Oh, that's a big boy, isn't he? See, we could have a big boy in here, but that would destroy a lot of what we've done. Um, I like this small one. I like that. Like, he'd be okay in there. But maybe... maybe I'll tell you what we could do, guys. How about... This is going to destroy a lot of what we've done. Okay. Um, this is going to destroy a lot of what we've done, guys. But hold on just a second. Don't shout at me too much, um, but we are probably going to wreck our original design. How about, just because this building looks so cool... Ah, I can't have that there. Now we're going to have to move the road, so... Um, yeah, I agree. What about those? You're right. You're right. What about one of those practice guys? What up, Atreyu, by the way? Hello. Good afternoon. Um, how are you today? Yeah, what about one of those practice fire towers? I agree, that's probably what I'm looking for. I don't think I have one. Um, but yeah, certainly we probably could have, we've got space for one, haven't we? Okay, so we might have to come back to that then. Let's um, let's just put in our small station for now anyway. Now these guys are all gonna hate me again. Um, so yeah, uh, you're, you're probably right. We, need, we do need something else in here. I think we'll have then with that in mind, okay, with that in mind, how about we do something like this? So we'll get, um, let's get a fence line here. Um, what we'll do is, we'll probably say, split this bit a little bit. Let's see if we can get that straight. Doesn't have to go right to that fence, by the way. I'm not too fussed on that side of things. We'll split that in two. We'll save space. I don't think I've got the prop for it at the minute. I, we can have a look. Um... Hey, more than welcome to link it, the squid guy. Please do, by the way. If you can find something you want me to put in the city, then please do, by the way. Please do. Um, so yeah, I, I've got I've got fire trucks that we can certainly put in. I've got those. I've got a little bit of smoke, um, and I've got a fire hydrant, but I don't have one of those towers. We can search for tower. I know which ones you mean, though, dude. I certainly know which one you mean. Maybe we should have come prepared for this today. Towers. Ooh. What a tower we could have. Freefall tower would be excited. Um, would one of those work? One of those might work. Um, <laughs> I do like that. That might work. What do you think? Um, we could get away with that. What are the squid guys? Thank you very much for the follow, by the way. Glad you, uh, glad you decided to make the jump. That's a bit too big, isn't it? I tell you what might work, seriously, that... That might just work, what do you think? That could work as a little bit of a fire tower, a bit of an example one anyway. Um, that might work, what do you think? Ah, like oh, the only problem, <laughs> look at it. Look at it with his little bushes on the floor, dude, no way. No, that would work as a tower, but no. 
Oh man, why did they have to have those on the floor? Um, that would work. The other option I have is just to have a big water tower. Maybe just tucked away here just for some reason. I don't know why there'd be a big one. Yeah, that makes sense. Maybe the... Uh, let's do that anyway. It looks... Um, it adds a little bit of variation to this. So, If you're wondering guys as well what the pipes look like in this city. Um, yeah, there aren't any. Um, I don't... I don't build with pipes, okay? So, if you're wondering why there are no pipes, then that's why. All I have to do is just do that and connect it. Little bit of a cheat there, guys, so you don't have to mess around with all your pipes, okay? A little bit of a cheat there for you. Alright, we'll have that water tower there. We'll find another tower that we can have here. We can set up a little bit of a scene with a couple of fire engines. What I'm conscious of is that we don't have any fire engines at the minute. Um, that's what I'm really kind of thinking of that we need. We need some fire engines. Now, I, I could place these individually, um, but we'll we'll be we'll do the lazy way. Okay, we'll be a little bit lazy. Um, I'm probably gonna yeah. I won't okay. I'm place these guys now. Obviously, for me that's far too many fire trucks. So we're gonna space these out a little bit. Now, do we want them that way? No, you know what. I don't like how that looks. We're going to search for it, we're going to do it that way. So. It is a cheat. A lot of what I do is a cheat, you got to remember that. i played this game far too long to not know how to cheat this game, basically. I think these fire trucks should be this way. Um, I think they look nicer that way, I don't know why. Um, what up, Frenzy Project? How are you? Let's park one up here. Good evening, welcome by the way. Behind the fire hydrant, of course, because that would just make perfect sense. There we go. So we have a couple of fire engines there. I like that. That works quite well. So we just need to put in a little bit here just to, to kind of kind of stop people just wandering through. Um, and we'll do it like that. What time are we on? Yeah. Excellent, guys. We're only going 20 minutes. Feel fresh today. Feel super fresh today. It's been a... Uh, like I say, most of my days these days are pretty tough. Um, today has been no exception to that rule. Pretty tough day, but hey, we survive. Hey, we survive. We'll just have that there. We're not going to link everything all up with it perfectly. I think that adds to a little bit of the, the kind of fun, really, of it. Okay. So we'll do that like that. All right. All right. All right. Okay. So let's see what props we've got. Uh, building New York, man. Building New York would take me forever, let me tell you. So forever now how about here then we have maybe there's a maybe there's a container that keeps maybe there's a container that just keeps some stuff in oh no it's the kind of thing that maybe we'd have um and i wonder if maybe just in this corner what about if we i don't know what these tanks are for but let's just do a few props in this area why not let's have uh, just have a couple of these in there I don't look too bad. I don't want to do too many of these. Um, at the back, I think definitely um, there's, there's always there's always boxes of things. I think we we'll make it look a little bit more industrial than we would do most normally. Um, I don't really want any of those things. I don't think a generator wouldn't be too bad. I think it might be common practice for them to to maybe just have a generator on site. Should there be any problems, you don't want the alarm to go down. Okay, that's what you've got to think. Okay, so we'll save that little space, we'll save that space for when we actually find what we're looking for in a workshop, how about that? Um, so this area then probably needs a little bit of stuff in it, so... We've got plenty of props that we can... <laughs> no box is all propane in the fire department. No, propane's fine, that's what they need, they need more propane in the life. Um, something's got to power them for when there's power outages. I might have some other props that might replace them. We could put a giant carrot there instead, dude. What about that? We have we have a giant carrot. No. Nope. Don't like the giant carrot, Navidus. I like how you are very particular about things, dude. I appreciate that. I appreciate it a lot. Um Okay, maybe not those. Ooh.
Yeah, we have a water tower there, friend. Yeah, we do have a water tower already, dude. Yeah, we're well ahead on that. A trailer, maybe? Okay, okay. I'll take your advice. It's been good so far. Take your advice. Um, what I'm going to do is, though, what's this shed called? Right, okay. So what we're going to do is, I think, I'm going to blow this shed up. Okay. Oh, my gas station is the problem. So what we're going to do is we're going to get this shed, because I like this shed, all right? Um... And I think we could turn this so it's a bit small at the minute. So let's... How big can we get it? So let's say that this is kind of like a little bit of a... The size of that. So we can have a little bit of a laugh with this, alright? We can... We can try a few bits and bobs. Alright, we won't use the propane tank. Alright, as soon as the people aren't a big fan of the propane tank being used. We will replace that then, and we will have, I think we've got to have some of these at the end. Um, we, already, we built a gas station last time out. Let's just put some of these in for the time being. I think it's important that people recycle uh, and have access to, uh, to bins, etc. Um, so why not? Okay. I think maybe, yeah, I, you know what, I wonder if we can probably get away with... And, and, and I haven't got enough stuff for maybe this, but how about we just have, in this corner, there's just a couple of these. Storing things. I don't know what they're storing in this fire station, but I think they're storing things anyway. Look at that shed. That shed works okay. Alright, let's see what else we've got. Because I don't want to spend all stream, like, going backwards and forwards to all the stuff that I've got, because I have, have a lot of things, okay? There's always dirt piles in these kind of places. In which case, then, what we can have is they probably have a little, they have a little trash collection, maybe. Maybe they just have this in the middle, like so, just to recycle things. I think they need it. Like I say, we're just taking up a little bit of space. We're not, we're not trying to, uh, we're not trying to totally fill this up. Let's have, have a couple of them. And I guess we're going to have to do, we're going to do that. Then we're just going to have to make it look a touch more. Uh, let's do this. We can do this right, actually. Well, how is everybody anyway today? Um, a trailer? Yeah, I'm, do I have a trailer? I have an empty trailer. These do look a little bit. See these fences, but still. They're right on line, like so, like that. Let's box us that area off. We're going to change some of the concrete around as well in a second anyway, so... But like I say, guys, I um, I don't want to get too wrapped up in going through the 800 or so props that I currently possess. It's a lot. Alright, it is a lot. Um, far too many to actually work out what I might want to use what for. <laughs> as you can tell. And I can keep going. I, like, I, I have this as well. I downloaded this. I'm going to show you this because... One of the things I want to do is this. Um, so I am going to be placing this all the way along the highway. Um, <laughs> that's going to be done at some point. Not today. That's an offline job. That's a, that's a job for another day. Okay, um, let's have a look. What else can we have in here then? We do have a few trailers that we could use. We've got a few tents, etc. I'm not too sure on those. Not too sure on those. We do have this, maybe. No, I don't like that now. That looks out of scale to that. All right, well, we'll, we'll leave it the way we are with that now. We can add more detail to it afterwards. Okay, I don't want to bog down with this one today. Uh, one of the things I am going to do is just tweak some of this. Um, I do have some smoke, and I was thinking about setting up maybe... Uh, maybe we can set up... I could place a lot of this, by the way. Maybe we could set up a little fire scene going off. I'm not too sure if we will or not. Uh, but maybe we will. Maybe. Let's just place this underneath. And the same here. Let's, go on. Okay. Let's get in there. It does need a bit more action. We could put in a few more fire trucks, maybe, in this corner here. Um, we've, we've got plenty of options. But for now, that should keep me... Happy. I guess the other inspiration I could take was from here. What else did we have? We just had cars in here, look. So here, look, on this one, guys, we just have the fire trucks. 
have the fire station and the police station together, so I really like how that looked. Quite simple. Closet and angle, etc. Um, everybody can use it that junction, so. Police and the fire station never get out. Okay, my game does lag considerably over that area of the map. So the water tower works fine, I think, for it. Um, quarry rise. Quarry rise wise, we are going to do that, by the way. So. I'm not too sure on that shed now, look at them. Uh, maybe we could have just put fire engines in here and we could have been done with it. So it's simple like that, but not to worry guys, that's how we go. Okay, need to come out of that. In answer to gas stations wise, guys, we do already have one here, um, which I think works. I love how that looks, okay, that works really well for me. I'm really pleased with that, I'm not changing that. That is, uh, that's one of the, um, that's one of my favourite things. Uh, one of my favourite things of all time, actually, I'd say. I do like that. Okay, um, let's have a look. Let's save the game. Whew. Okay, let's get stuck into a bit of detail work then. Yeah, 7 Eleven. I almost said 7 1 1 then, like a complete idiot. Um, but no, they. Um, that works brilliantly well, I think. It just looks like it belongs in that area, it just feels like it's right. Okay, so just so you know guys, I don't think I'm going to do too much of it today. This kind of stuff is going all the way down here. When I mean all the way, I've got, got probably half an hour's work of detailing to do there that I don't particularly want to do today. What I did want to show you actually, I forgot that I did this, was what we're going to work on next. Get this a little bit secret. So you can see that most of the blocks aren't very detailed around here. Um, apart from until you get to here, okay. So I spent about I spent about 40 minutes just on this one block, okay. Um, so and th this is where it's hard to kind of explain um, everything. So all these fences that you see, every fence that you see, there's a fire straight away. Um, all the fences that are along here, um, that run around the back, there's another fence here. Um, all the fences have been placed by hand, alright, using the prop line tool. And I thought, what can we have in this area? And I built a little, I built a little posh barbecue area in the middle. So that people can go and chill out, and I really like how that ended up. That just feels like a nice little park. And then I thought, well, we probably need a park as well. So, I left a nice little bit of space. Um, I left a nice little bit of space here, really, so that we could have, we could build a little park for people, basically. Uh, and I think one end I wanted to have, like, just some football nets at this end, that's it. And this part will have as other stuff as well. So, we're going to get on with that now. We're going to go from there. And then, like I say, guys, we have, or well, I've got into the habit of doing a tour every, every hour or so that we stream. So, we'll have a tour in about half an hour, I believe. That fire station went up very quickly. Okay, we'll use these ones. These are, these are good enough. So we just want... We just literally just want something dead simple. Okay, we're going to do that. There we go. Then all I'm going to do is ruin. And all we're going to do, once it decides to find it, Never works as well. I hate that. I hate that. I hate that. It's not ruined. What's the other one that I want? Um, which ones do we have here? Barman. That's probably what I want instead. Okay. Okay, that's the one that I want. Okay. We'll do it that way. <laughs> Jumpers for goalposts. If you can find me a jumper. Asset. I mean, I will quite happily. Um, I will quite happily uh, put a jumper down. By the way, um, but until that time, no, we're going to have to use old posts. Um, there we go. Oh, these are slightly different ones as well. So incredible, what different stuff I have. Why would anybody have two different versions of uh, of football nets? I don't know. I don't know. There we go. So it's back from. 
There we go, that should do me there. I just want a small bit there. Okay, this side, I think just so, I just want a couple of trees in here. This is one of the nicest areas that I think I've ever built that's just so, for me, understated. Um, I do love how that... What up, cat? Do you want to go out? I might have to go and let the cat out, guys. Let's just get... In two seconds, guys. Cat break. What up? Not had a cat break for a while, guys, by the way, so apologies about that. Okay, um, where were we we're doing this? So let's get a. I, I know which tree I want, I want more of those trees. Just some small ones. Just tucked in in this corner. So we're going to have one. Like a different size. If that's one. Just something like that. That's it. Not too much. Not too much. I don't want this park to be overgrown. That's not the look that I'm going for with this. But I just want to protect that little... I want to protect our little barbecue area from a menacing stray. Give him a bit of a break. That looks nice. Okay, so we are going to use these because I, I think these are the... These actually... Oh, we're not going to use that one. These look pretty nice, actually. But let's have them. We can spread these out nicely. You know? have a couple of the swings like so. Oh and again, don't wanna do they're so small it's silly. So let's get this. Let's line this up shall we? So I do want four of these together so <laughs> Thank you, CJ, for it. Thank you. Oh dear. So placing these is going to be a bit of a nightmare for me. Because they will have to go incorrect. So now that one has to go. They all seem different sizes or slightly different sizes. I find it slightly easier to overlap them. I just want a bigger sample. Maybe I'm greedy. Maybe I want too much. We'll get away with that. I hate saying we'll get away with that. I know that we'd never get away with that. Um, maybe a slide as well. Maybe there's a maybe there's a nice slide just here. Maybe we get rid of the sand pits and add a nice slide. All right, we're adding a slide there. Same effect again. So we're going to use this ruined stuff. We're going to just go a bit too much, just that little bit there. That's it. And then you've got to be careful. You see. That's why I don't use this very often. Come back. My cap there. I'm very greedy in particular in what I want. I think I can get away with that. I can get that way. No, we can. We're going to change that then. We're going to do it this way. In fact, that looked nicer, I think. Thinking about it. This is going to look a lot nicer doing it this way. Uh. Okay, so this is obviously a little bit too wide for the gap that I've created. So, what we're going to do then... Let's get those sides roughly even. And then we can hide that, alright? It's a little bit of, again, another little bit of a trick that we can do. So if ever you get a point where we use this one, we we'll use this one actually. If you get a point where you can't quite get the detailing right, cover it over with one of these. They make it look like it's a professional job. Um, oh, it's been warm today. No, I mean it has been warm today. Let me tell you. So um, my recommendation, headshot. Just to go out and buy the game, dude. I, I think you're missing out on so much if you are um, buying a pirated version of the game, dude. Um, I think it's a little bit... It's been cheap enough, like, it's down to, like... It's super cheap at the minute, dude. Um, 
you really should go and buy the game and support the developers, man, really. Like, I, I can't... I can't stress enough how good this game is. Yeah, for the... It's cost me about 22 pence an hour to play, yeah? Um, so you should go and buy the game, really. Um, you won't get too much love in here, Headshot, for saying you have a pirated version of the game. I don't think it works like that. And the truth, I don't particularly feel like helping you. Well, I have nothing against you as a person, but yeah, don't buy the game, dude. Oh, well, if you know, well, fair enough. And I'm, I'm an honest citizen, so I don't help pirates. So, unfortunately, we're at an impasse, me matey. So, yeah, that's what I'm gonna say. Then, okay. But you seriously, man, if you don't have enough money for this, then. And you're not willing to pay for somebody else's hard work, then yeah, I'm not gonna help you. Sorry. Yeah. No worries, headshot, dude. Take it easy. Hope you, uh, hope you can, I don't know, sell some kind of body part to generate the cash uh, to be able to, uh, to be able to buy this game, dude. You're missing out. So. Was I bad with that? I don't think I was too bad with that. Um, oh, zoning on highways sounds fun. I don't think I'd ever do it. Okay, we just need a couple of let's uh, let's use the orange trees that we've got over there. Call this area kind of orange grove or something like that. So I wasn't too harsh on headshot. I hope I wasn't too harsh on headshot. I don't like being harsh on people, but. Buy the game, dude. If you want to play it, buy it. Save up some cash. Yeah. Earn something in life. Yeah, you know. So, I, you know, I don't want to. I'm going to help somebody you like. Like, you're not exactly good friends with the good people at Paradox, but just so you know, guys, the good people at Paradox. Is, Gave me a free copy of Snowfall, like because I was streaming the game. Absolutely destroyed my game, by the way. Completely and utterly wrecked it. But they came in and went, really appreciate the fact that you're taking time out to um, just to stream our game. Like, hey, do you want a copy of Snowfall? I'm like, yeah, hey, hey, uh, please. Absolutely wrecked my game. Absolutely wrecked my game completely. What do you think to that little park in the housing estate? Oh wow, well, that works, doesn't it? That works. Mm. I was trying to give something else funny to say, like you can go and walk the plank or something like that, but I, 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 I ran out of inspiration, really. Uh, it's hard enough to talk to you guys and play this game at the same time. How about that, guys? That really works well, I think. Could you imagine? Can we do? F I'm worried if I do first person mode, I'm never going to get out of first person mode. So if you want some first person shots, we're going to have to do it again. So. Alright, okay. Well, that works really well. I'm really pleased with how that one's turned out. So, um, let's do something along this highway really now. We are going to have to place one or two trees along here. And one of the things I was thinking, I was thinking about this at work today, which is quite bad, um, <laughs> was that I've kind of evenly spaced out all these trees here. So, what I was thinking of was kind of having something a bit more dense in certain areas, just to mix it up. So. Um, I know Owl that made the map, he kind of got it right with a few more areas that have got a few more trees in. Um, so yeah, I, I was thinking maybe we need to we need to maybe do something like that. So I want to get this side completed along here basically. I did consider putting, like I say, a crematorium here, but... <sighs> do I have a crematorium next to the train lines? We need one. We do need one. Let me just have a look at the space gaps that I've got. I've got a lot of crematoriums to choose from. What is that? A oh, clinic. So we do have space. 
not going to go that way, guys, but we do have space, so it's what, it's six. Alright. I don't particularly want to build anything off of this main road, though. That's my only issue, but... Okay, let's have a look at this. Oh, do you think commercial more there? I... <laughs> You know what? We're gonna go for it. Right, guys. Welcome to Crematorium Build Part One. In fact, whew, thank you for reminding me. Um, we are gonna record this. Okay. I don't know what I did then. I think I did something. Hold on. Nope. Oh, that's doing something over there. Why is my shadow play not working? Ah, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I know my shadow play doesn't want to work. Okay. So we're going to run this along here, I think, for the time being. That might change to a pedestrian path, so let's wait for that. I think what I'd like is... Yeah, I, you know what? I would like a road that runs there. So let's just shift and P this up. Let's do this. Let me just check something. Low shadow play. Uh, oh, F10. No. Yeah, I know it doesn't sound brilliant, but... We can we can work something out. You won't be able to see it from the train line by the time we've done with it. And good afternoon, Itchy, by the way. Hello. Thanks for dropping by. Yeah, I think I think I'm gonna get away with it. Pretty sure I'm gonna get away with this. Let's see though, shall we? But maybe that's just because where it is. I it doesn't Yeah, I guess why not? So I want that one more over, so whatever happens with this road, it's got to go. It's got to go. It's got to go there. Okay, which means that that now has got to be a pedestrian path, which is fine. You're not going to snap for me. You're not going to play a snapping game. Let's see if you do. That's fine. That is fine. We don't need this path. We're not having a path going over there. We don't need that path there. Okay. And then I think what we might do... Yeah. we do something like that. Bear with me, guys. Another path that goes here. Now we're all going to kind of... I think maybe as soon as we come out of that path, we're going to swish this like this. So this is going to take a little bit of swearing to do, I think. We want something like that. Uh, bend it off, thank you. I, I believe in the jazz vision. The, the optimistic vision. Yes, it's bad. The blues. It's bad out here, but it's going to be cool. Okay, maybe we just need to tweak that. That needs to be a little bit more, doesn't it? Oh, we're about right with what we wanted, though. Okay. Let's see. Build something exciting. I don't think I've ever built anything exciting. Let's have something with a bit of a feature in it down here. So what I'm thinking is, and I know this area is heavily treed up at the moment, which is probably detailing that I've done that I'm now taking out, but watch out for the bears. Let's make this area quite nice, I think. So let's have this hook. Let's have it hook a little bit shorter. Road probably that path probably needs to go somewhere. I would have thought so. We'll work out where that path ends up, or maybe it doesn't. Maybe it could just go something like this. Okay, 
Oh good, the cat wants to come back in there by the way. <laughs> oh look what we're thinking. So here. Yeah, that's quite a nice design. Or well, it will be anyway by the time we finish. I think. Yeah. Along here we're just gonna have a nice wall. Yeah. So that we'll put that in now. Early morning on the weekend, scrolling through your phone, scoping what people been tweeting. I don't know guys, I don't know if you think this is right or not to have this um, in this area, but well, I think it's something a bit different anyway. I usually use this wall around about here. Okay. Let's just tone that down. Let's tone that down too. Okay. And let's turn the prop spacing down to zero. Just got to test it out and see. Yeah, that's obviously spaced out too much. Some of them look a little bit better when you tweak. There we go, maybe. Maybe to that, that's better. Okay, so this has got to be, try and be as straight as possible along here. Glows quite a lot, doesn't it? So these walls are notoriously difficult to get straight. I'm going to go to about there. Okay, that works for me there. I feel like I'm in full concentration mode, guys, in truth. So apologies if I'm not actually talking to uh, talking to too many of you at the minute. I want something that goes in there. I want that, I want that line to continue, basically. So let's do... Let's do, let's do, let's do... Let's do that, I think, maybe. No, no not like that. Sorry, guys. For that, and I won't look at this. Okay. Prefer that. The reason for that, I prefer, I prefer having that, I like that. I like how that's shaping up now. Okay, so the other side here, we're just gonna, we'll, we'll build a car park in there when we get tacked around to it. Then we can really tree this area up here, that'll work for me. Okay, so, what we're gonna do to mix this up, I think, as we should, so let's just snap there, we're gonna snap here. We'll go quite as far as we were, okay? That doesn't look particularly straight, does it? <laughs> it's got to be straight. That's not straight, so it's got to have to be there. Okay, we will take it to there. No, I want to. I want just a little bit of a tree line up there. Okay. It's important to get the paths right in uh, in these kind of areas. Okay, it's important to do that. Uh, what did it come under? It comes under here anyway, so I should have these options under here. Okay. That will give us the space here for a nice, a nice little feeling. Watch out for the deer, by the way, guys. That that is something you gotta watch out for. We should be able to fit one of those in here too. I would prefer not to have to move the path. So okay, so they don't have to match up exactly with it. I should get rid of the trees there. They do have to match up with it. Oh, my mind goes a bit crazy. They do. Sorry guys, my mind goes blank if it doesn't look right. Okay. This is probably one of the bigger crematoriums that I've ever built. We'll have that. Now I'm thinking here. Um, we can either have one of those in there, or I think maybe we can go a little bit more... Maybe we can go a little bit more special with something here. Um, so how about we look at... Look at getting rid of some of these trees first of all. And I think we might go over this with a specific tile as well, I think. 
There's a couple of bits that I'm after. I don't know what it's called, but I'll know it when I see it. I haven't really, uh, really used it that much. Somewhere in here, so... It's probably one of the bits you want to, um... Probably one of the bits you... There we go. What's it called? It's up two. Okay, so it's quite, um... Oh, thank you, Itchy. I, li I like Itchy's up-to-date scores. So, I quite like this. But it's a little bit small. Okay. So, it's kind of that size. I'm going to even keep the prop spacing up a notch. Alright, so what we're going to do is we're going to... Now all we've got to do is get that in line with the centre of that building, okay. So, that's what we're going to have, alright? And that'll be a much better size. Okay, perfect. Perfect. So remember, it's called Tomb, guys. So it's going to probably be about here. That's ideal. Okay. Now we're just going to make sure that that's squared up. And we don't want to place two. That'd be a nightmare. So instead of just having a small cross, we've now got a nice big cross, I think, which I think looks a lot better. A lot, lot better than what it could do. So here then. Imagine how we're going to have this. We're going to have a path off here. Is that in the middle? That's good. So we're going to have maybe square here, I think. Okay. Let's plan this out then. Let us plan this out, guys. And then this is another area done. We're almost getting close to tour time as well, so in three more minutes, guys, we'll have a little... Uh, we'll have a little wander around if you guys are interested in that. See where we are, see where we're up to. Have a look at some... Nice shots of the, uh, of the city. That's the worst place to place that in the world. Let's have it in the middle there, like that. Let's have it like that. There we go. Yeah, Itchy, we're building up to one, Itchy. I can, I can feel one on its way. Um, I can say three minutes time or so. We go. We'll go and have a little tour around, so... I think in this area we're going to have plenty of benches. We're going to make this area look quite nice. Um, as we normally do, so it's a nice little tomb for somebody. Um, don't know who it was, they're obviously quite rich. Because they can afford to have a tomb like that. Um, we won't bother taking that one out, we'll just cover it over. Okay, that does that. Um, so then we're going to shape it. Well, we, could, we could curve these, but I'm not going to. So keep that like that, I think. Okay. That's nice, I think. That is nice. Let's just carry on building up these details. Bit by bit, by bit, by bit, by bit. Until we get uh, to where we're looking at. So I think we're going to have a smaller one here. Why not? Then we can have another one on this side, like so. Um, how much space do I have there? I don't... No, I don't want that. No. I don't want that either. We'll have we'll have a look at some plazas here, and we'll have a look if we can work out something that we can that we can design around this area. So that we'll get to that design point. So yes, yeah, so don't worry that it's right next to a um, as it's right next to here. We'll fix that, and then we'll go for a tour. Um, oh no, pressure! Twenty um, twenty seconds to go. Twenty seconds to go. Unbelievable. Till we go on the tour, so. What up, RJ Monk, by the way? Good afternoon. How are you? What's this one? Minus 40 we did it at. We'll do it at the same size. Okay. Now, this wall's probably going to continue, but uh, we, we're certainly just going to have to put it in to about here. I, I don't want anybody on the train line. I'm slightly off of that.
I hope all these don't actually count towards my uh, my asset or my prop count. So, oh. all right, let's quickly save it then. That's straight enough, isn't it? Yeah. The whole of that doesn't look straight to me. I don't feel like that's right. I feel like that can be done better. Sorry, guys. <laughs> That wall would bug me. How far are we thinking of going for a car park? We'll probably go to there. That's real close to the trains, but... It's an easy way of doing it, isn't it? We're not going to have much space between them and the trains, alright? We're not going to have much space, guys, but... Um, not to worry. Alright, okay, quick save then. Let's um let's move on from that a little bit. Let's do a quick save. Alright guys, so for those of you that haven't seen this before, let's have a quick look around. Uh, good old fashioned Davenport. I need to change I think my first person camera mod because it's not working. Uh, but it's nice to take in some of the sights and sounds. See I could have extended this lake, I did think about that, extended that all the way up through here. Um, I might put another one in this corner. Balances that out then. I don't think that's going to look too bad uh, where it is. I think that's quite nice. I think it fills up that space nicely. Um, so I'm happy with that anyway, even if you guys aren't. Um, so what do you want to see, guys? Anything? Oh, look, I love it when a train comes through here. So obviously we have a train. There's two trains on the way through. Oh, my God. Is he stopping there or is he going all the way? He's going all the way to our second station. Brilliant. I could sit there and watch that train go through. So yeah, we have um, this. Oh, I tell you another bit that I, oh, I finished off another little bit, guys, then I was offline and I haven't shown you. I do love how that looks, by the way. Oh, I can't click on him. Um, but yeah, we finished off some of the extra detail in here, so we have a lot more wood trucks now, uh, which I really like. Um, a lot more empty wood trucks as well. Um, I think I, I saw this picture, I took this picture the other day. Uh, something like that. And the picture that I've got of it is just phenomenal. I have the details turned down at the minute, guys. Um, because there's too many of them. Far too many of them now to actually get this game to run at a decent speed. Um, still like my industrial area. Still like how that looks. I think that I, what I like is that I realise that that road is the same angle as that road, and it just seems to tie everything in together. See, sometimes the the irregular bits look the best. Like as much as I try and be perfect, I like the little irregular bits. Like I like the fact that it's not even split as well. I didn't get it the same height. Just little irregular bits. Um, I was thinking about adding this and turning this into a bridge along here. Um, which would then give me a bit more reason to have trees etc here. Um, so I might I think I'm going to turn this bit into a proper bridge over here. There's a bit more of a feature for the rest of the city. Um, yeah, the other bit that I finished was the end of the sewage works here, or the recycling centre. So I just added a couple of these little sewagey work type buildings. Which I think, I think work quite well with this, the, these kind of dual recycling centres. Um, and I look, I, they, they're just more buildings essentially. I'm not too sure on the trees, but um, they don't harm it in any way. And I guess if I wanted to, we could have some pipes in here. Maybe we could get my infamous propane tanks in that area, guys. I, I want to blow stuff up by the looks of it. Um, but I do like that. Um, so yeah, I think I think we're about up to date with everything. Itchy, I'm not too sure if you've seen. I mean, this, this, this I do love. Actually, like, like, like a way around. That I do love. That works on a lot of levels, a hell of a lot of levels. Um, with how it all flows together, with how it all, how it all just fits in. I need to put some cars in there though, because that they can't actually get to that car park. I um, mean, it annoys me when they park on the road still, but it just looks so nice. It just works so well. Um, the tennis courts I love, uh, next to the running track, the basketball courts as well, 
Um, and even these little gardens, which is probably one of my more creative things that I've ever done. I just think that that looks so easy. Um, there's so much work going into getting that to work, by the way. Um, so much work going into getting that to look like that. Um, and then, yeah, the whole kind of campus of it works. I mean, we don't even we don't even come and look at the kind of entrance, the grand entrance to the school. Um, I haven't even got a picture of that. Um, and I should. I'm going to take one. We're going to take a picture of that. Yeah, we're going to take a picture. Um, because why not? I think that's um, I think that's a beautiful little screenshot. Okay. Um, and like I say, we've done... I'll show you a couple of examples of the detail work that we've done downtown. So, uh, this path, for example, here um, has been detailed so that we have a bit more woodland alongside it. Okay, a bit of a pain to do. Um, same with same with that kind of fence in there. And all these have had um, extra flowers put in them, bushes, etc. Um, I really wanted that kind of little neighbourhood where kids would play on the street like that's how I grew up playing on the streets roughing it guys roughing it uh, but you can see the difference it makes when you have see this area has been detailed here this area hasn't now there's this I've done a little bit by the looks of it but it makes I think it makes such a massive difference to it just those little those just those little subtle bits like that make all the difference so I've got all that to do all along here um, but that path is really popular. It's like one of the most popular paths in town. Guaranteed to meet somebody you know on that path. Um, then obviously we've got the new neighbourhood really, which uh, which we've been working on today. Little fire station. We need a fire tower, um, and that shed's huge, isn't it? It's almost as big as that building, but it's just a building. Don't know what's in it. We don't have to know what's in it. Okay, it's just a building. It's just there lurking away. Um, and then lastly, but no least, we've still got this area to work on, guys. Uh, the game runs a lot better when I'm in this area. Um, one of my favourite bits that we don't see very often is this uh, little cycle path separated from the road. Love that. And again, all the detail that goes on along the side of here. Look, beautiful. Absolutely beautiful, like kind of um, smallish neighbourhood area around here. Really like that. And the go, and the go, and the go, and the go kart as well. I don't know if you can tell, guys, but sometimes I actually look at this stuff and I go, wow, you know what I mean? Um, I've messed up the traffic here, but we'll fix that, we'll fix that. Right, okay, let's crack on with this then, because we're up to we're up to getting this looking nice. By the way, guys, the plan is to have, in this area, we're going to have a large city hospital. I know it's next to the train lines. We'll be able to fence the train line off, that's fine. It can work in this space here. Okay, so it's going gonna, it's gonna to kind of sweep along here. Um, we're going to have several different types of buildings, but we're going to have a large hospital in this area. Because they don't have a hospital in this city, believe it or not. So, so yeah. So I've got to kind of really fix one. Is that, is that Wall Street? Anyway, tour over, guys. That's, I hope you enjoyed it, Itchy. I know you requested the tour, so that tour was free of charge, by the way. Other tours may cost money. So, all right, okay. So let's crack on with this. I like having that little path there. That's quite cool. Um, I don't like the fact that there are bears walking on through the gravestones. I think that's disrespectful, animals, um, and I don't think that that should be done. So, um, so I'm not happy. Okay, we've got to work out how we're going to get to this little special area here, and what we're going to do to get that to to blend in. Really, I guess the easy option is to take all that out and just put in more gravestones. Yeah, you know what? It's not that it's the easy option. That doesn't look right. It doesn't look right. It's going to be a pain to delete. There we go. It just doesn't. It doesn't feel right. Um, things don't feel right. Then they don't feel right. I can't. I can't be held responsible for the feeling. Just got to remember that. Okay, so we'll do that. I think. But I do like how that path moves. In that. Okay. Yeah, I think that's better. I feel I feel much more comfortable with it like that. Okay, so now we've got to get rid of the bears, dude. Dude! You're so close to, like, a busy town, dude. You're going to get shot. Okay. I think we're not going to put too many trees back in here. We're going to let that be a view. Like, nice little view on the lake. 
We've got a lot of details to add around that lake, so we're going to start from there. We're going to work our way back down. Towards the crematorium. Okay. We're getting a little bit funky as well, guys, ladies and gentlemen. And welcome to the happy hour. So there we go. There we go. Let's get this up and running then, guys. We're going to have some fast camera moving. We're going to jazz it up a little bit. We're going to make this area. This this area needs way more of a Tavish kind of touch to it, I think. Um, so let's get working on that. Yeah. I don't really want to do that. I like how that looks. I think what we want to do is kind of line some of this. Just a bit, a bit of a hedgerow. So we're going to use the, um, we're going to actually use the prop line tool for this one. I'm going to go from there. Okay. So we're actually going to do this almost... Uh, we're certainly going to do this... Uh, rough. Okay, that's not kind of enough. Um, I was fine at the minute. We can... Just want a little gap about here. Oh, it's getting well into that. Just okay. Now I always think with with um, with trees, etc. I don't have to be quite as precise because nature nature doesn't grow in straight lines, but walls do. I always remember that. Lesson number one in life. Okay, so we're going to mix up this hedgerow. We're going to find the other shady bushes, which are... I don't even know what that looks like. Okay. I'm going to go back along here. Need to just make sure that... You are actually placing something. Have we got that right? There we go. <laughs> what up, Skynet? Good afternoon. How are you? Welcome, 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 dude. Welcome, welcome. Thank you very much for the host, by the way. It is much appreciated on a uh, Wednesday afternoon. Bit of a slow day today. Bit of a nice detailing day for me to get a bit more... I always like getting a bit more done. Building the city is uh, it's hard. Oh my God, let's go. I often wonder if I'm, I'm, if I'm probably as quick doing this myself. Right. Hello. Let's have some, have some a few bushes in mind. So, okay, that's starting to work real nice. I think that is starting to to come together. I forgot we need to do this side as well. So apologies for that. Because I want to, like I say, I want to. Try a different style with this. Okay, my cat is desperate to come back in, but I'm looking for the cat. What the cat doesn't realise is that even though I can hear it, I'm going to pretend that I hear it. I don't like those bears, by the way. Those bears are um, bears are putting me off a little bit today. Uh, shh, shh. Okay, like I say, bit of a, a bit of a painful process. We're gonna we're gonna start making this. We're gonna start making this ourselves now, so we need to fill in some of the gaps. Easy. 
easiest way I can do that is. But these streets, by the way, are so heavy in triangles, but they are absolutely um, rocking out. So. so let's get some of those. We've left a gap there. You see, you see why we're going to have a little path along there in a second. So I'm about as quick doing it this way, in truth. So. Welcome to watching somebody place a moon among bushes in the City Skylines game. Uh, my apologies, we've only placed, I think today's building count is three. So we've placed three buildings today, guys. That is all we've done in today's stream. Um, grand total of three. Uh, three buildings in today's stream. So, I'm quite happy so far. Um, that's that's good, that's good, that's good for a PMX2 stream. So... I'm quite happy with that. I am more than happy with that. That's, uh, as long as we, listen, if we can get this done, this is going to look... I have a, a couple of ideas that we can do. Yeah, so if we can get this done nice, then... I'm going to take a few more minutes. Imagine how nice this is going to look. Imagine if you would... Imagine if you had relatives that were, you know... Unfortunately, this, is, this would be a nice place to take you want to take him here, okay. I don't know what the Norfolk Island Pine... Oh my gosh. Why have I never used that tree before? Never used that tree before. Never, never. What up, <laughs> my new dream, how are you? Good afternoon. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Let's just top this up. So we're going to go through this anyway. This should be... Uh, I should have maybe bit of other stuff but we, we're gonna add to these hedgerows as we uh, as we go um, you know what like I know the railway line is just behind me here but I can't help but feel we made the right choice by having this here um, no I'm great thank you I am great Wednesday that means three down two to go for me anyway this week so I don't work Saturdays um, I have the uh, nice idea of having the weekends off to myself. <laughs> Though I've got a few jobs to do around the house this weekend, so um, I could have could have done some of them this evening, but uh, I decided to come and stream. And when I've done finished here, by the way, guys, uh, when the stream over, when the stream is over on here today, which is not for oh, another forty minutes or so yet, we've got plenty of time. Um, I'm going to go and play some Overwatch with my wife. That looks lush. Okay. That is looking beautiful. I don't know why I didn't do trees around here. Um, do you think it needs it? Does it need it? No. No, it doesn't. doesn't need it, Pete. Don't, don't think that it does need it. What we need is, you know what? I think we are going to... We're going to find that little Norfolk pine kind of tree. Um... We're going to find that tree again. So I really liked it once in a way. I don't have more of it in my city. Um, probably this one. The reason that we don't need it there, we're going to... Sorry, dude. Oh, my goodness. Why don't I have more of that? Um, why don't I have more of those trees in here? But anyway, bye bye. Alright, so, um, we just want to get a couple of these bad boys sneaking in around here now. I know, like I say, he's near the railway line. No. But this area definitely needs details around here. Um, I'll cope with that. We'll probably need a few more along here as well. Um, but I I'm focusing on this side of the tracks today. Don't want to get... Don't want to get too waylaid. Okay. A little bit of a wall along here. We'll put that in. Uh, we'll take that. That area is done then. <laughs> I thought it was just sweet today, bien. Oh, never mind. I know nothing. I don't even speak French, by the way. So. Okay. Guess that one's going to be too. Oh, 
Oh, that's, I guess that one's going to be too perfect. Is um, now what I'm thinking about. So, it's just like this. Where are they coming from? Oh no, have we got floating people? We have floating people, guys. Um, good call, Cushman. Look at these guys. Where are you going? Oh, there we go. They've gone. Maybe they got scared. They saw the bear. They saw the bear and they got scared. That bear needs to go. Alright, I'm not in favour of that kind of nature. Alright, so. That gives us that little view, I think, of, of a nice little quiet lake area. I like that. Um, what we need to do is kind of block out as much of the railway line on this side as possible. So, we do need to do that. So we do need some trees that we wouldn't probably usually use. Uh, I mean, this hides it pretty well, but we need something with a bit more, we need a bit more bulk behind them, okay? So it's, it's, um, it's not going to work. They'd be good, but they're too big. I always feel like they look in a haunted house. I like them, but I feel like it's a bit like a haunted house kind of tree. It scares me a little bit, in truth. Okay, let's have a look at what else we have. We have them. I haven't placed many of those. Maybe there's a reason we haven't placed many of those. I'm not a huge fan, that's why. Um, the other option. Okay, the other option is to use... Maybe have something like that. We're going to do this. We're going to have a little experiment. We're going to have a little bit of fun. <laughs> Goes to the graveyard, gets killed by a bear. Well, at least you don't have far to go. Yeah, that's what you've got to think. Yeah, you don't have far to go if that happens. Okay. I'm going to draw a big line of these. All right. Um... So we're going to draw a big line of these. What we're going to do is that we're going to... That's too close. Start again. Still probably a bit too close. But I'm going to take it. Oh, that works for me. Okay. The reason that that works for me is that we can then go... ...do this. I guess I could place these trees in a line as well, then it will all perfectly fit in here. Um, but maybe not. So... What up, Maddox in the house, ladies and gentlemen? Buenas noches, indeed, senor. How goes it, dude? How goes it? Okay, okay so, the only problem with that is, obviously, the underneath isn't quite as nice as I'd like it to look, so what we're going to do is just going to make it look a little bit more, a little bit more realistic, I think. Okay, um, just a touch should, and I've got a bit of leeway with this. I have a little bit of leeway to make this a touch easier for me. So let's just line that up with the railway lines, and uh, then we can. This is going to um, this is going to take a, t a few seconds to get right anyway. So we do just want to line it up with that, and off we go. So what I'm trying to do is create almost, if you like, the illusion of a path down here. Now I know that these trees are in the way, 
it is just an illusion, which means that things aren't always what they seem. Okay. Um, but my idea is this, that we can go... Just gotta watch that path, because it will look awful if I get that wrong. Oh, that's nice. So if this is going to be gravel anyway, let's make it gravel. At least, at least we all know where we stand in this game, so... Um, yeah, I can't get rid of that bear, by the way! just waiting for you. It's lurking, I tell you, man. It's not Yogi, it's the Reaper Bear. We have the Reaper Bear. Okay, do we need a couple more of these? I think it looks silly that we haven't finished this off down to this edge, actually. So, let's do that. Sometimes things just happen as they happen, if that makes sense. You can't... You can't force things to happen, right? Is that going to place a second one there? Oh, my gosh, this is going to be... Uh, this is going to be a bit annoying to get right. <laughs> Should have thought about this, Pete, shouldn't you? Hey, you're not going back and changing it all though now, buddy. Oh, <laughs> you're not going back and changing all this. That's about the right area, but it needs to be. These are so awkward to get in the right place, guys. But One day this mod might get upgraded, then everybody will start using it. Okay, that should do. Quickly, put some trees on it, Pete. Put some trees on it. Nobody will ever notice. Okay. So that, I think that hides pretty well um, the fact that we have... Okay, let's have a look at it now, though, guys, because it's getting there. It hides that fact. Like, look at that now. I think that's working. I think that's working real, 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 real well. Okay, so we probably do need just a little bit of a... We just need maybe one more. Just one more and then we're going to have to stop messing around with that. And then, let's have a look. I like this kind of gravel aspect to here. So, we might just do a little bit of something different, I think. I want to experiment with how this looks anyway, so... Got a few plans afoot. Just one. Is that equal? Is it equal, guys? Is anyone? In? I think that looks nice. I think that works well. I think that works well. Yeah. You guys might think differently. I I think that, that um, I think that's looking real nice. Real nice. Okay, so we do need to do something kind of here, I think, to, to finish this area off. Yeah, we've got a moose. Hello, Mr. Moose. Need to rename. Oop, need to rename the moose to something else. Um, let's rename the rename the moose. Moose. I can't say it. Death. I can't say it. Try saying that. Death moose. Don't say that when you've been drinking, guys. It could uh, cause you problem. Hill home. Gaming, good afternoon. How is the PC? How are you? When are you back streaming? Why am I not up to 2am in the morning watching you? Where have you been? In no particular order, okay? No particular order. Um, I think here, rather than, should we have... How about we try... Could we do this? How about we try this? Alright, now this, this may work, this may not work. Okay. Um... Okay, let's have one of those there, I think. Um, I think that's working, but what we're going to do is... We're going to go... We're going to go off the scale. Okay. So this is just going to be a bit tricky to place, but... It's the biggest we can... Just go whole hog. Okay. This is really tricky to place. So which corner is it picking up on? It's 
Does that annoy everybody with it being at that um being at that angle? It probably annoys me. I need to have it straight. So it's just gonna take a, a bit of uh, random time to do um to get this to work, but Oh no, it's not I'm gonna do it straight away. We're gonna do that. Then we're gonna get some smaller ones. I'm in. I'm zoomed in, guys. I can feel that I'm zoomed in to the TV screen. In fact, let's uh, let's just run that. Swear break. Okay. Uh, maybe that's not kind of the look that we wanted to go for here. Oh, that works for me. That works for me. There is a reason for this as well, and I guess, yeah, 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 yeah. Got it, got it, guys, got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. Know what we're gonna do? Let's move on with it. So, oh, setting up all the screens is a real pain in the uh, in the, uh, the backside. I have to say, I hate doing that. I hate setting up all the screens. <laughs> the screens is uh, are awesome. Uh, oh, awful, sorry to do. I'm gonna do this. It's gonna end randomly in a second, but so yeah, I like that. And I think we are gonna go around this with a touch of gravel. Let's square that off. I like this idea, by the way. Um, yeah, it could be. Uh, attractive dam. It could be the place for a cross. Could be. I wasn't thinking that, but it could be. We could have... Have a think about this. Yeah, I like I like the fact that we had the cross there. What I was thinking was, though, in here... Th th this is... this is. Let me, let me talk you through my plan, attractive dam, if that's okay. Um... I was thinking that we had, we could probably have like nice, a lot more flowers in this area, so we could make this a little bit more of a focal point. But then where could we, maybe we could have a memorial cross out here. What do you think? What do you think, Attractive Dam? Happy to listen to your ideas, dude, by the way. Uh, welcome, by the way, to the chat. Maybe we could have a cross there, like it's a special grave. It would certainly fill that gap up. I th see. I think I need to do this. I, I really like the effect that this gives in this graveyard. I really like it. I'm probably gonna get carried away now, guys, and then go. Oh, I don't like it, Pete. Why did you do that? Somebody get uh, a bear exterminator. By the way, because uh, because yeah, this bear is uh, this bear is frustrating me a little bit. I like that with that underneath there. That works for me. Yeah, there's a little bit of an experiment because I've got this side to do something with as well. Um, let's have a look. All that is nicely grown, isn't it? Not really if it's too overgrown, but at the same time. Bear. Look at that bear. That bear is just in there, isn't he? Okay. That's looking nice now. And I think with a bit of a yeah, I'm not going to go with the cross there. I like the idea. Um, it's a decent. It is a decent suggestion actually. Usually we'd say that that would go. Um, but just on this occasion, it's not what I had in mind. I don't think. So. A yeah, good hill home. It's about time you stream. Streaming is rubbish. Okay, so we need a few lower bushes there. Okay, okay, okay. So let's build this little bit up then. Let's make this little bit look nice. And I think what else we're going to do? I don't know whether to have one of those trees there. Um, no way. <laughs> Ooh, some lampposts as well, wasn't it? Now we're talking. Now we're talking the detailing. Um, Alright, attractive. I like that. I like how you're thinking. What up, Neely boy? Good afternoon. 
and we have one or two familiar faces popping back in and out today. I do like it. That tree's not moving. So we want kind of like a... Um, do, I, do I want to go with that tree? It doesn't seem enough. Uh, doesn't just doesn't doesn't seem enough for me. No, I'm going to stick with the tree on the other side. Good afternoon, guys. Welcome. By the way, hi. Hello, if you have just joined us, and I'm not shouting your name out. Good afternoon to all you lurkers as well. Um, I really love the lurkers, guys. This 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 graveyard this graveyard's for you guys. I like the people that lurk. Lurkers are my favourite. Um, what I think is, yeah, this is this is maybe something that might appeal to me as well. So in certain areas, and stop me if I'm wrong on this. Yeah, I'm probably not. I like the idea of this um, to go along here. So that looks. Uh, I know they're only small little flecks of stuff, but because what we can do in certain areas, then yeah, 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 yeah. Just a little bit. Of, um, I'm getting into this little bit of detail in session now. Um, I'm terribly annoyed that I haven't recorded this, by the way. So, terribly, terribly annoyed. Um, curse shadow play. It's going to save me a job on Sunday doing this, but or on Saturday, sorry. Okay, we still need some trees or bushes along that side. Uh, but yeah, I'm happy with that. So we shall do that. Okay, so we need. In fact, it's easy doing this. So, going that way. Don't like knowing where the stuff is that you want. And I obviously still don't know where stuff is on this one. Oh, this is going to take a while to get right, isn't it? Um. They do, Usman. They do. You must, Usman. You must follow me on. Um, you must follow me on my YouTube channel. Surely you do. You know that I exist in the world of YouTube as well. I was quite surprised. I got. Um, what am I up to now, actually? Um, oh, no needy boy you should never lose the uh, gaming. Never you lose the gaming touch. Games will be with you forever. Really like that. Really like how that is. Yeah, I'm, I'm surprised. Um, I got. Um, I'm up to four four hundred. What am I up to now? Four hundred sixty-two. Four hundred sixty-two subscribers on YouTube, and, and I don't really do that much. Like, it's awesome. Um, I'd love to get to five hundred. I guess five hundred's become. 500 has become that attainable dream that maybe I should get to. That looks really nice. Okay, so in here I want some... What's it called? I, I know what I want. I know what I want here. I have one that we don't use very often. But yeah, I got up to like 462 people on YouTube, which is just awesome. Um, that doesn't quite go as well as I thought it might, but, um, but there we go. <laughs> Thanks, Alex. Yeah, that is that is that is the awful truth about me. I will put you off video game. Ah, uh, I know you. I, I kind of know where you're coming from, Needy Boy. I kind of know where you're coming from. Um, and I'm going to say one of the strangest things that I never thought I'd ever say to anybody. Yeah. Um, the best. The best way to get out of, for me anyway, the best way for me to get out of a bit of a slump, and it's hard to do at first, is to do some exercise. Like, and I don't know if you're healthy or not. I, I don't, I don't know. And please don't see, tell me that. I'm not trying to teach you to suck eggs here, dude. Yeah, that's not the idea behind this. But um, they say that exercise is. I'm going to let that overflow over there. Yeah, look at that. They say that exercise is like the best thing. It's one of the best cures for it. It's still got a little bit jazzy, hasn't it? Hard to do. I'm not gonna lie to you. Real hard to do. 
Oh, they had a minute. Um, but if you can, maybe that'll get you out of. Maybe that gets you out of the slump. And you can always look at it this way as well, and I always think this as well. Um, you never kind of know that you're down until you're back up again, so it may mean that you're turning the corner. And again, I, I don't, I don't know. By the way, I'm no. I play video games. Yeah, I'm a video gamer. Yeah, I, yeah that's all I do. Yeah, I don't. Don't, don't, don't take my counselling sessions as, uh, as gospel. <laughs> well, Pete said, yeah, no, Pete didn't say that, but Pete says a lot of things. So, <laughs> yeah, it is. Somebody, what did somebody say to me once? And I wanted to punch him in the face. Um, and my wife still wants to punch me in the face on a daily basis. Um, dude, why are you playing this much? Like, why are you playing this much saxophone? This is not helping me. Um, I don't like this grass, I forgot what I was saying now, this sax has put me off. I think the hardest thing somebody else said, the hardest thing somebody told me to do was to actually put your trainers on. And I was like, hey, what are you on about me, you fool, putting your trainers on, yeah? Like, putting your trainers on. Anyway, how many times have you been to football this this year? And I was like, oh, I want to... And he's like, yeah, exactly. The hardest thing to do, guys, is to put your trainers on. Once you're doing whatever it is that you're going to do, you're fine. And I was like, do that. That is a that is a valid point. The hardest thing to do is to put your trainers on. Once you're doing it, you've done it. Oh my god, this saxophone is doing my head in. Next. Place the stuff in the corners again, I think. Shout out at me. Probably on a bigger tree there, I think. So we'll have just a couple. Yeah. So we wanted that cross there, didn't we? Looking out over the lake. So. Now he's just playing and blowing down the damn thing. So I could do that. Okay. Let's add in a few more details. Right here. <laughs> okay. That's the reason why that wall ends because of that. What up, Lord Grow? How are you? Uh, please, please tell me that your the train your graveyard has a railway line running alongside it because that would make me feel loads better too. Um, and if it doesn't, then sorry for stalking you. Uh, and welcome, by the way, Lord. Um, I like it when people praise me. Good. Thank God that saxophone's ended. Okay. Can you believe you spent? Yeah, you can believe you spent an hour. I can believe I spent. An hour. Ah, that's better. It's chilled out a bit more. And I know it's tough, Neely boy. I know it. I know it's tough. Yeah. And when you're down in the dumps, man, it's horrible. Yeah. And nothing, not even the mild light entertainment that Pete McTavish can bring you around, dude. Um. So. And I know it's not easy. And it's always easy for somebody else to say it, but when you're actually going through it, it's never that easy, dude. So. All I can say is, dude, keep smiling. All I can say. Whatever it is, it is. Whatever it will be, it will be. There's not much you can do about anything. So, I've already told you, actually. Um, what up, Ghost? What up, Jaron? Good afternoon. How are you guys today? Um, and lurk away, Ghost, by the way. Um, and <laughs> Satan 3, how are you? Good afternoon. Everybody seems to be piling in, guys. You always seem to leave it until the last, like, the last few minutes to come in and say hi. But you're here anyway. And that... That is all that counts. Okay, so we're actually starting to move somewhere on this now. Um, that's real nice. That is uh, that is real nice. There's no trains run on that track anyway. It's like a ghost train. Um, that is. What do you think? I don't think we should place many more trees there. I think we need to do that little. We need to have that cross here. I think just at the end of the. Uh, just at the end. Oh, look at that now. Yes. I am being very American and clapping myself. I'm sorry if that upsets you as American, but... Uh, <laughs> well, I'm going to do it anyway. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. That is... That 
That works. That works, guys. That works a treat, doesn't it? That? I'm pleased with that. I am pleased with that. Okay, just a couple of bits then. Just a few more bits to finish that off. Um, oh, link it, Joe. Link it, 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 link it. I like new buildings. I'm all excited now. Buy new buildings, etc. Okay, you just want to get in a little bit of this stuff. Don't want to do too much. Um, we'll have a tour in a few minutes, guys. How about that? Maybe about 10, 15 minutes or so. Um, what time are we on? Yeah, 15 minutes. We'll have a tour. Maybe, no, we'll call it 10, actually. Um, and then we might have to, unfortunately, wrap things up for today, guys, with that. So, so yeah. Bit of a sad day. Really. So... Alright, okay. So we said we wanted that cross there. What's it called? Can you remember? Wait, let's see. Let's test. Let's test if Attractive Dam was paying attention earlier on. Attractive Dam, if you can tell me what prop to search for that cross to go there, then we'll have it. Okay. You have... You've got 30 seconds, yeah, to come up with an answer for me. Um, there isn't a prize on offer for this one, I'm afraid. Okay. Um, I think you can just permit stuff. Just link things away in this. I need to fix that. So yeah, you have you have a few seconds. It's time to get it right. If you don't, then we're not putting one in. Okay, that area needs a lot more detail in doing to it, doesn't it? So, 597 meter building in Fitbit. Yeah, would. Why not? Let's have it. Um, instead of this, maybe we have a little bit of this growing, just a touch. Just a touch. You can tell I've been watching Bob Ross lately as well, guys, so apologies for keep saying just a touch and things like that. I love Bob Ross. So, I was watching Bob Ross the other day, and it wasn't Bob Ross that was painting, and I was like, someone's having a laugh with me. Alright, try to dive. If you give up, you give up. Yeah, we're out. Got the two. So, that's a bunch of flowers. So, do we want just a simple cross? I think that'd be... You know, just a simple cross there is a bit more... Poetic. Or do we want it a bit bigger, guys? So we can... We can we can make it a touch bigger, but it... It, it didn't look quite, quite... It might not look quite as effective. That's going to be huge, by the way. <laughs> look at this bad boy. Maybe something twice the size is good. Okay, right, there we go. No, it wasn't even Bob's son. I, I, I recognize Bob's son. Me and Bob's son go way back. I like that. It's a wolf. I just want to be careful how we do. Okay. Oh, 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 I want to go and click it. I want to go and click it. I want to go and click it. Now, we have people walking on water. Like, the dead have risen. Dead have risen in this game. I've been telling people for a long time, Ghost, like, and I've been asking modders to make a mod that just changes the prop size. Nobody wants to do it. So, I do it myself in game. When it reaches the masses, then uh, everybody will love it. When it, uh, when it. I don't really want these touching. I just want to get them in the middle. You're not going to be able to. Uh, learn these days, guys, that you can't probably tell this anyway, so. It does look a bit daft, I think, doesn't it? Um, let's have a look at this building, by the way. Bear with me, guys. We're just having a look at a bit. Oh my gosh. 
big man. I love that. I love how you put it. It's big. Um, <laughs> I think it would fit perfectly in here. Um, by the way, guys, if you do want to check out, um, Jaren's one of the people that's made me a lot of uh, a lot of really pretty things in this city. Okay, um, so please go and take the time to go and follow him on um, in the Steam Workshop. Make some really creative items. Um, and really kind of pushes the boundaries if you ask me so by all means do so guys um, I'd appreciate it if you would um, so please go and, and follow um, Jared in the uh, Steam Workshop it would be greatly appreciated um, obviously that building is maybe not necessarily what Davenport needs but hey um, I might get in trouble with Addict for that from the right eyes with the right eyes you can't hardly tell um, Do we need anything around that, do you think? Maybe. Ooh. Maybe. So yeah, please like I say, head over to um head over to Jaren's uh, Head over to Jaren's place in the workshop. Go and get some items from him. Guy deserves it, yeah. So what we'll do is we'll just beef up some of these areas as well, just to make sure. I don't want to do too much. I don't want to do too much. Okay. Do that, then maybe. Maybe. Just. Uh, I really want to, you know, set this area on fire, I think. Do that. That grass is going to be too long to have any. Yeah. Now, I, I do like having this grass in the middle because it creates like a. This one's having put one. <laughs> yeah, I knew I didn't say sloppy work. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, just, I think that's looking pretty good. Okay. Um, I think that's looking pretty neat down there, I think, guys. Okay. Seems a weird place, like I say, to have um, to have a graveyard. Um, yeah, mausoleum would be nice. Yeah. It does seem a weird place to have a graveyard, but... Um, or, a, or a graveyard, churchyard, or whatever you want to call it. Um, place of death. I don't know. Whatever you prefer. Um, but I think... Once we get round these trees... Chug, 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 chug. Yeah, I like that. If I could get rid of those pesky bears. Yeah. Um, if I could get rid of those pesky bears. Um, that would be even better, but... That's well nice. I know people will moan at me for having the train line right there, but it is probably possible to move it. Okay, um, it is probably possible to move it. Okay, so let's have a little bit of who, who runs in here, guys. If you fancy a little bit of a tour around, let's go and have a look. We spent an hour or so detailing that little bit. Should we have a full tour around? I might actually use this maybe for uh, either uh, my shadow place absolutely dead to the ground. Okay, absolutely dead to the ground. Okay, so welcome guys to the wonderful city of Davenport. There's not masses to look at um, from afar, okay? It's not the biggest city you'll ever see. Um, it's not got the tallest skyscrapers you'll ever see. It's not got loads of traffic links. It's not one of those. What it is, is an attempt to make kind of like a small detailed town. Okay, this is what Davenport's all about. So from, uh, from above, that's pretty much all you get, guys. Okay. Um, that is that is where we're up to. I think what we're going to have here is we are going to have a little bit more of or taller buildings in this area. Okay, so we are going to try and do um, we are going to try and do something a little bit more tall, if you like. So, what up, Johnny White? Good afternoon. How are you? Thank you very much for the follow. Welcome to Davenport. So, we'll start like we always do. Um, and sorry, guys, for jumping around. I have turned the settings so pretty much all the way down, but there are a lot of details in here. So. Gives you an example of the kind of details that we have. So we have fully done coastlines, okay? This coastline stretches, um, the detailing stretches all the way down here, down to there, um, which I think is really nice. Um, so again, stuff on the train lines. Again, with every attempt is to make it look as realistic as, as possible, okay? That's kind of where I started out. 
and that's that's the kind of attempt that we make. So some of these buildings are missing, by the way. There's an industrial building that's is that even zoned in there? I don't know anymore. Yeah, I I, I have a few problems with things. Okay. Um, cheers, Imran. Thank you. So yeah, it started with this this railway line, and to give you an example of the kind of details that we do, the building, this area here is made entirely out of props okay that's not an asset that's not anything that you can download in the workshop you can download all the props if you want but that's made entirely out of props okay built that hand me um still a fan of this area looks a little bit nicer uh, we'll have a little float around okay um and just again i love how that looks so we have not only do we have a little train yard with the sidings we have a little area where people can work on etc. I've destroyed a little bit of that. I, I extended this area out so that we had a slightly bigger train yard over here. Um, again with a lot of kind of custom stuff in the middle here. Um, I love how that worked out. That worked out so nicely I think. Um, especially down to the fact that the, the cars don't park on the gravel. There's little bits of tarmac there for them to park on, which I think is a really nice little touch. Um, and we go all the way to the trouble of having a rusty car at the back here. Might just be able to see it behind this tree. Um, really like that. And uh, really like, I think it's about this view. Somewhere around here. Is it? Follow me on Twitter, by the way, guys. You'll find a picture. Something like that. I can't quite remember what it is. So then we built, what I wanted to do was build a sympathetic industrial area, okay? So we built uh, this we'll have a look at it from above first um, which somehow seems to work it just I like it. the roads look better when you have it that way it just seems to work much better on the eye when it's that way don't know why but um, but it does oh yeah we will save in a second um, say <laughs> I want to say Satan, oh, I'm go Satan. Uh, but again there's loads of detail work in here that you might not see so um, these cars are placed by hand in here uh, the little the little planters that are in here. There's another moose there as well, man. The mooses are going wild. The animals are crazy today. Um, same applies here. So this fence, everything that you see really is all proper place. Um, I extended this little bit. So we have a little bit of a waterworks at the end of our recycling centre. Which I think makes a bit more sense. It looks like it belongs there. It's the kind of stuff that you'd get. Alright, it's the kind of stuff that you'd get. Um, along with that. What up, uh, what up, attractive Adam? Thank you very much. Or oh, attractive Adam, I want to, I want to call you attractive Adam. But I like attractive Dam. So, sorry about that, Adam. And how attractive are you, anyway? Um, little bits like this at the back. So we have, um, we have a little truck pulling out of it. I think that's brilliant. I can't remember who told me to do that. Um, yeah, okay, Osman, we'll do that. We'll do that. Um, but again, nice industrial park. That's another crematorium that we built here. Uh, most of that is apart from obviously the buildings, it's custom stuff. Um, we have our schoolyard here. We, I like this school as well. Um, so we have the tennis courts over there. We have the little kind of like school football pitch. I love that. I love that. It reminds me of my youth. Um, those, that little cafeteria area here, it's kind of like in my mind, I'm thinking Greece. Yeah, when they're dancing around and waving all the hands and stuff like that. Um, I can just imagine people having to go to this high school, yeah, and, and I, I always find that fun. Um, all the houses are set to a specific housing type so that they end up looking pretty much like a neighbourhood, which I like. Um, this custom park's not super special, um, but it looks quite nice, I think. It just sits in there. Um, that view's pretty nice. I, I do like how we've worked that clinic in. Um, I do like that. And again, just some custom stuff all the way through it. Uh, there's another school somewhere over here, I think. There we go. So we have a little high school or an elementary school here next to the next to the public library. Of course, you need a library next to it and you do things. And again, the detailing is... It takes a lot. <laughs> this is all I'm saying. Um, but I really like... Some of the stuff I like about this city is having these paths go kind of here and then here as well. So they're not all perfect paths they're just shapes I think and I really think that makes it a lot more organic or a lot more realistic you know um, I know I like straight things but I think that works with some of the paths um, it's something that we've touched on here as well so um, I really like how this works I really like how we have that kind of wide path there 
um, little barbecue scene going off here, guys. Um, yeah, I, I like how that looks. And again, how the path breaks through here as well. Just, just gives it little touches. Um, we'll skip over the shopping mall. If you, it's just a lot of buildings that have been placed. Uh, and a few details as well. So, um, I don't like the shopping mall anymore. I want to change it. But I haven't got the patience to change it. Then welcome to downtown Davenport anyway. Or an attempt at downtown. We don't have too much going on. Um, I'm gonna, I need a few more buildings this size would be brilliant, like eight stories high, something like that. Um, another one of my favourite shots. I think that just could be, just be an American high street anywhere for me, that, and that's the kind of look that I wanted to go for with that, I really enjoyed that. Um, and again, we're slowly working our way through this area, so we have uh, these taller apartment blocks. I really like how this area came out. So. Um, really like the petrol station that's here, sorry, gas station. Um, the sort of the Starbucks is at the side of the road, really like that. Um, and then the RBC, I don't know what that is, but it looks nice there. Um, and then this little, this little uh, checkers, little checkers place there, little checkers place, love that. Um, and then just a little rundown pub at the end, or, or a bar, late night bar. Still got this area to finish, as you can tell in here. And then, like I say, I'm gradually going to claw my way through these streets so that they all just look... I need to fix the, my uh, logo. So they all just look like this area with loads of these flowers at the front. And I think that's going to look... That's going to look super cool, I think. Uh, we finished off the school. Like I say, the school has been done. We'll have a look at an overview of that. Again, really like that. That's a big high school, really. That's the only school building, the library as well. A couple of elementary schools there, more fields that you can see, tennis courts, etc. The small football pitches. Um, getting the roads in there was, was the hardest thing to do. Um, but yeah, again, really pleased with, really pleased with the results, even to the point of having a little, a little play park at the back of that. So, um, yeah. good afternoon, Metalis. How are you? How are you? Um, welcome, dude. Welcome. So really pleased with how that looks. All this is kind of fresh still, not really detailed much. We have a little suburban police station. I'm not overly impressed with this. Um, it's pretty pretty simple, pretty straightforward, pretty basic. Uh, same with the little fire station that we started with today. Uh, maybe I did do a little bit too much industrial stuff. Need to get a bit more, um, a bit more fire station-y kind of stuff, really. But all this area's got to be done. We did this. This is just this is a real nice little diorama, if you like. So um, this, I think, looks really nice. Um, how it just is it's alongside one of the busy roads. That just works really well. So we have a 7-Eleven next to uh, the petrol station, and it kind of looks like it's linked to this bit, but they have to get off here. But I. I like how that looks. I liked how that looks. I like how this road junction looks as well. I like that little little kink off there. It doesn't slow these guys down anyway. So it doesn't because not many people come in from this road because it's all a mess. Okay, it's just all a big mess of a road junction here. Um, so I need to go back and fix that something terribly. Uh, the last few bits, obviously, we'll have an overlook of this. I still remember when I built this. My God, I wish I'd recorded building this because. That I love. Um, that's where I really started to get in, fall in love, fall in love with Davenport. I was like, that. I'm going to build a Grand Prix track or a go kart track, and I built one. Um, so I really like that. And again, I told you before, I love the mini golf course. I love this little diner. But there's loads of places, guys, that I, I don't even take us to see on tours these days. So um, the baseball field, I always forget that I have the baseball field in here. Um, I still think it's excellent. I love it. Uh, and again, same with the paths, how the paths work. The paths uh, feel kind of realistic, so there would be one down there. And they're different shaped sizes, and I like that. It balances it up. Um, and then one of the kind of original bits that I was aiming for uh, was this little kind of like downtown area. Again, nice little arbies. Um, and I put in a lot of these cars are, are props, by the way. Uh, to make it look like people go there without the props, they'd be it'd be an empty car park. 
a big fan of this park. I don't know why I like this little area so much. I think it's these benches that work against these fences. Look really nice. Okay, really like that. Uh, but again, like I say, the little details that you may miss. So along this railway line, there's all this grass stuff being added. Takes a long time. Um, same with this as well. That's all custom at the back end of that hotel, which I, I really adore that. I um, don't see that often enough. We haven't got a train station with no trains ever going to it. Uh, looks like that needs a bit more detail into it, into it. But just so you know, that's an asset. That corner bit is all props in there, so we can sneak props in at any particular time we want. But we've got to redesign a lot of that, unfortunately. So we're going to going to spend some time redesigning how that road works in there but without trying to damage too much of this. Uh, so all that is probably up for renewal. Um, and then Osman said he wanted to see the city at night, so... Oh yeah, and lastly, by the way, we have just built this. Um, I don't know I'm going to take a picture of it. I, I, it's not quite completed yet, but... The way that that path looks... No, it's not detailed enough in the background for me. We're not going to take a picture of that just yet today. That's what we've done. All right, nighttime view then. Nighttime view, and then, uh, then we'll wrap this up. Hold on to your hats, guys. Everything's going to get a little bit darker. I don't place too many lights. See, I like it at this time of day. Because you just get... You just get some wicked... Um, Some wicked like this with the sun coming over it. Okay, let's go a bit further than this one. And nighttime doesn't look brilliant. I don't see. It's about there. That. That for me is like the. I just like how that looks. It's very dark on your screen, guys, but it just. It just. The colours on the water just look nice. <laughs> See, if you look at it from this way around, you get even more kind of a light on the city. Um, but yeah, I think that looks pretty, yeah, pretty cute actually. Yeah, I don't, I don't like it much darker than that. You just end up seeing like just roads and. Um, I don't think I don't think it looks for me I don't think it looks overly special. You get to see the road layout pretty decently from above though. Um or just about anyway. Quite dark I think. Um, but you get to see where the major kind of arteries are in the city. This road's gonna really change, this is gonna change. There's so much to do guys, so little time to do it in as always. So like I say, I would prefer maybe that time in the morning because then I'll show you this one as well because oh it does not like the shadows because then I get the morning sun and it just looks it just looks nicer I think for me so um, so there we go so I hope you've enjoyed your time here today anyway guys thank you for all the people that hosted me today you are wonderful people thank you too for um, all the people that follow today you too are wonderful people if you want to skip through a lot of what I do which is fair enough um, I talk some absolute rubbish at times um, please feel free to go and follow me on my YouTube channel um, we might be on the road to 500 by the way um, which could be quite scary um, so yeah I am a little bit scared by that on the road to 500 YouTubers uh, would be ace uh, and by all means guys for some exclusive pictures Head on over to my Twitter channel, uh, slash Pete McTavish. Twitter channel? Twitter feed? I don't know. One of the two. Head on over there, guys, as well. You're more than welcome to message me on that as well. Ask me some questions. Got something that you want me to see? Then, um, or see or do, then ask away in there. Um, and that's it from me, guys. So, hey, thank you very much for watching this evening. Thumbs up from me. Have a great evening, guys. Have a great rest of the weekend. We shall be back on Saturday, I believe. Um, and if not, I'll notify you on Twitter. So, did I save? I'm not too sure. To so take care of each other, guys. I don't do anything I wouldn't do. Respect for each other. Enjoy the debate, life. Enjoy life. It's there to be lived. And have a good one. And I shall see you all later. Um, that's it for me. I am officially out.